47% of adults in the United States over the age of 30 have some form of gum disease. That's 93 million Americans. Based on US statistics, it is shocking to realize that worldwide, 1.8 billion people suffer from some sort of periodontal disease. Even in healthy athletic people, bacteria that cause gingivitis and periodontal disease can travel anywhere in the body and are shown to be associated with heart disease, stroke, and diabetes in the same way smoking is associated with cancer. It is a silent killer. So what's the cause and how can it be eliminated? Up to 600 types of bacteria can live in the mouth. Among these, only about 20 are bad. These pathogens live below the gum line. They grow very fast, doubling in number every five hours. They hijack our immune system, causing it to destroy our gum tissue instead of the pathogens. The pathogens feed on this destruction and get into the bloodstream where they cause life-threatening inflammation in other organs like the heart, the lungs, and the brain. We use the phase microscope to determine if someone is at risk for or has active periodontal disease. We take a sample of the bacteria from under your gum and we look at that under a slide under the phase microscope and we can see a live picture of the bacteria. If there's a lot of movement, we know that person is at high risk for dental disease. If they don't do something to eliminate that cause, they will get destruction in their mouth. You have a choice. You can spend hundreds of dollars treating the cause of dental disease, or you can spend many thousands of dollars treating the results of periodontal disease. Which one would you choose? A dentist who doesn't have a microscope is kind of blind. Most dentists are neither diagnosing the disease correctly nor treating it correctly. Gum disease infections have been linked to diabetic infections, to joint infections, to Alzheimer's disease, to at least a dozen or more systemic diseases. Periodontal disease is a bacterial infection that can be treated. Our treatment identifies pathogenic bacteria and we can determine what needs to be done to eliminate them. We do everything possible to make sure that you keep your teeth. Ask your dentist for a microident bacteria test to help the dentist identify the cause of the problem. Bacteria are the root cause of gum disease and microident identifies the 11 most aggressive and destructive bacteria. You need to treat the cause of the problem, not just the symptoms. Understanding the bacteria and being able to use bacteria testing such as microident, that helps us know the cause, not just the symptom. You want your dentist looking for things that you're not aware of because by the time you're aware of them, they're already a pretty big problem. And that's why we call it a silent killer. You should ask your dentist if he does any microbiological testing for pathogens or bad bacteria. And if he doesn't do any testing for bad bacteria, you should find someone who does. For more information, go to the website on this video.